Scripture tells us that it is by the love we have for one another in the faith that people will know, the world will know that we are God's disciples. You see, this love draws people. This love is action. This love has no falsehood. This love carries us through hard seasons. It is this love, hey, glory, that the world will know and be convinced and want to be a part of what we have, the Christian faith. It's the drawer, not us. It's not as much as we preach it with our mouth as we live it with our lives. So Father, fill us afresh with your love. The love Love that flows from heart to heart and breast to breast. Uh, the love that contains no falsehood, no slander, no murder, uh, no lies. The love that is true. The love that overcomes. The love that prevails. The love that forgives. The love that shows mercy. Uh, the love that walks side by side. The love that bears burdens. Uh, the love that shares the load. That love that really cares. Uh, the love that is action. Not, and not just words. This is the love uh, that the the world is longing to see the love that we should be filled with Jesus love for us and Jesus love for one another. This is the love beloved. This is the love that the world is longing to see how we love one another in the body of Christ. It crosses denominational lines. It doesn't just happen on Sunday morning when I see you, but this is the love that people need to see the body of Christ need to come into the love of Jesus and love each other in truth, in truth. See, love, this love won't let me lie on you. It won't let me slander your name. This love will not allow me to gossip about you and say negative things about you, but it will cover your sin. It will cover your sin. This is the love of God.